Hello and welcome to this video tutorial on Atom Editor from Code Karikama with me Abhijit Jagdish. In this video, we shall see how we can move around in Atom Editor. For the sake of this tutorial, I have created a large file called largefile.py. This is basically a large file with some text in it, you know, just for the sake of showing you a few tricks on how to move around in Atom Editor when you're working on your code. Now, let's say if you are here in your editing your code uh, next to envelope and then you want to move to the beginning of the word envelopes in that case you would press control left that will take me to the beginning of the word that i'm at and if i do control left key again it will take me to the start of catalog again start of papers so this is how you move one word at a time to your left what if you want to move to the right control right key that will take me to the end of the word or to your right again control right key moves one word to the right so that's how you move one word at a time to your left or to your right let's say you want to move to the first character of the line you basically press home so that will take you to the start of that line first character in the line similarly if you want to move to the last character in the line you would press and that will take you to the last character in that particular line. Let's say you want to go to the top of this file. Let's say we are here next to can become. And now I want to go to the top of my file. Then I would do control home. That will take me to the top of my file. To the starting of the line, it's just home. To the top of the file, starting point in the file, control home. And to go to the end point in this file uh, you would do you guessed it right control and that will take me to the last point in this file uh, let's say you found out there is a bug in your code or there is a typo in your code when you're trying to run it error message says the error is on line number 101 and column 20 in atom you can do is press control g that will open this palette you can see at the bottom here there is a message enter a row or row colon column to go there example 3 for row 3 or 2.7 for row 2 and column 7 we want to go row number 101 and column 20 so all i'm going to do is 101 colon 20 that's going to take me to 101 column number 20 uh sorry column number 20 and we can confirm that with left hand side bottom corner you have 101 row 20th column uh, those are the few tricks you could use to get efficient while moving around your code. What if you want to close the window that you, that you are looking at? You do Control W. That will close the file that we were looking at. To learn more of these tricks, I suggest you go to Atom web page, and in there, in the Atom web page, you have the documentation section, and in, when you click on Atom manual. There is in chapter two, under chapter two, using Atom, there is a section which says moving in Atom. This basically contains like all the information. Uh, we covered some of this. And then you can, I suggest you come here and explore yourself uh, to find out more cool tricks on how to move around in your Atom editor. To recap, in this video, we learned few tricks to move around in our code. In our next tutorial, I want to show you some nice packages that I find very useful when I'm using Atom Editor. Till then, take care and thanks for watching.